Look at this video clip. It's about a Chinese child who is eating dumplings. Can you believe that it's not real and is made by AI? Yes, this video is AI generated. And this one, it's not real, but look at the quality, the realism, just outstanding. Not a single morphing or unusual movement. Now look at this 10 second long drone shot of this beautiful historic church built on a rocky outcropping. It's just amazing. Now you can also create this kind of outstanding video clip with an AI tool called Kling. And today, I will show the capability of Kling AI. So, without further ado, let's dive in. This is the Kling AI dashboard. Here you can see we have a couple of different options like AI images, AI videos, and their video editor which is also coming soon. These are some of the example videos generated by the community. Alright, to start creating videos, we have to create an account first. By the way, you will find the link in the description. And upon the first sign up, you will get 66 free credits. These credits will expire after 24 hours, meaning you will get 66 free credits daily. Enter the AI video generator page. Now let's try the text to video first. Here you can see the prompt section. We have to enter the prompt here. For example, I am typing, a majestic African lion walking on a lush jungle. It's a very basic prompt. Let's try with this simple prompt. After entering the prompt, go to settings. First, you will find the creativity level here. If you slide this level to the left, then the video will be more creative, and if you slide it to the right, then it will follow the prompt. I will keep it at a moderate value. The next option is mode. You will find standard and professional modes. The professional mode can generate superior quality videos. This feature is only for the premium user. By the way, the paid plan starts at $8.88, where you will get 660 credits. In the pro plan, you will get 3,000 credits for just $12.88, and in the premium plan, you will pay $28.88. You will get 8,000 credits along with premium features like extending videos, removing watermarks, and others. Okay. Let's see the difference between standard and professional modes. First, I will go with standard mode. After the quality, you will find the video duration. Standard mode allows only a five second long video. In the professional mode, you can generate videos up to 10 seconds. Next, set the aspect ratio. Here you can generate videos in landscape, portrait, and square ratio. I will go with landscape. After the aspect ratio, you can select the number of videos. Here in Kling AI, you can generate a maximum of four videos at a time. Only Kling AI offers you this feature. This time I will generate two video clips. Even further, we have the camera control. So if you want to use any camera controls like the horizontal, vertical, zoom in, pan effect, or rolling effect, it all depends on you. One more interesting feature is the negative prompts, which I haven't seen inside of Luma AI, its direct competitor. This feature helps to avoid unwanted objects such as I am typing, bad quality, bad anatomy, blurry, anime. Once everything is set, hit the generate button. It will take some time to create the video. So let's fast forward through this part. And here it is, our videos are ready. Let's see the first one. This five second long video is just amazing. I love the result. It perfectly portrays a lion walking in a lush jungle. And most importantly, it is so realistic. And this is the second video. This one is also an amazing video clip. There is no morphing or glitches in the video. That's great. Now let's see the result in professional mode with the same prompt. I am just changing the mode and the video duration to 10 seconds. Once everything is set, hit the generate button and wait some time. Okay, this is our newly generated video clips in professional mode. And the difference is clear. It could be seen with the naked eye. The video quality is just amazing. The realism, detail, and light. Everything is top-notch. Same with the second video clip. I can say that Kling is the best text-to-video generator I have ever used. Let's see another comparison. I will generate another video with the same prompt, but with Pika Labs. After coming to the Pika Labs video creator page, I am entering the same prompt. Next, set all the necessary settings. I want to keep it similar to Kling AI. Once everything is set, hit the generate button. And here is our Pika generated video clip. Now let me know in the comment section, what is the difference between Pika and Kling AI? In one word, I can say that Kling AI is far ahead of Pika. Now I am going to generate another video with a complex and rich prompt. This prompt is actually used on Runway Gen 3 Alpha to generate this video. Let's see how Kling AI produces the results. 
I am going to the professional mode and 10 second video. This is the result. And the result is amazing. Here the left side video is generated by Runway Gen 3 Alpha and the right side one is generated by Kling AI. I can clearly say that Kling AI generates more complex but realistic videos. Although the video is 10 seconds long it keeps it consistent. Light and composition is just amazing. Not only the realistic video, but you can create other style videos also. Let's try to generate an anime video. I am entering a ready prompt about a Pixar style video of a boy playing football. You will find all the prompts used on our Discord server and Telegram channel. Link in the description. Okay. After entering the prompt, set all the settings, and then hit the generate button. And here it is, the video is ready. Honestly speaking, the video quality is just outstanding. Kling AI generates a perfect Pixar style video for us. Keeps the character consistent although, I asked, and it generated some complex movement. So, now you can create a Pixar style animation video with Kling AI. If you want a tutorial video on how to make a fully animated film with Kling AI, let me know in the comment section. Okay, not only from text, you can convert your images to videos with Kling AI. Just go to the image to video tab from here. Now you will find the option to upload images. Click here and upload the image. Here on the top of the preview panel, you will find an option to add the last frame. If you turn it on, you will be able to add the last frame of the video. If you have a perfect storyboard, then this feature could be a game changer for you. This time, I am skipping this part. All right, next, you can add an additional prompt or skip it. After that, set the creativity, video duration, and mode. Camera movement is not allowed in the image to video section. I think they should enable this feature. Okay, once everything is set, hit the generate button. And this is the generated video. It's a pretty cool video, but we can create more personalized videos by entering additional prompts. Let's try it. I am uploading the same image and entering a prompt. Basically, this prompt was used to generate the same image. Now without any other changes, I will generate the video. And this is the resulting video. You can see that this time, the video is more qualityful and subtle. Another important feature is that you can actually extend the video. You have to click here. You will find two options. Auto Extend and Customize Extend. I will go with the customized option. Next, you have to enter the next prompt and then hit the Extend button. This is the extended version and it's amazing. In this way you can extend more and more. This is not the end. When I just finished making this video, Kling AI released another big update. They released their Kling AI 1.5 version, which is just amazing. Kling 1.5 model allows you to generate 1080p HD videos in professional mode at the same price as before. Compared with model 1.0, Kling Model 1.5 shows a significant improvement in image quality, dynamic quality, and prompt relevance. Let's see some of the example videos. Here are two videos with the same prompt about a Chinese girl slowly looking toward the camera. The first one is generated with Kling 1.0, and the second one is generated with the new 1.5 model. The new 1.5 model brings significant improvement in dynamic quality. Here are two videos with the same prompt you can see the difference. Another important feature Kling AI adds is Motion Brush. Now you can upload a picture and specify motion trajectories for up to six elements, people or objects, etc. within the image. Additionally, you can designate static areas for certain elements to achieve better motion control and performance in your video. So, this was about the Kling AI. Honestly speaking, Kling AI is a gem in the AI video generator industry. It has a huge potential to lead this industry, and I hope that the team will work to make it more powerful. Alright friends, I will wrap up our video now. Before that, I would love to hear your opinion about the Kling AI video generator. Share your thoughts and results in the comment section below. Don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful, and subscribe to our channel for more amazing tutorials like this one. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, happy creating.